I've always had what I would consider to be is of an average size penis, as far as my testicle sack goes, they've always been above average in size. My scrotum is about 160 pounds or so and still growing. The weight is probably equal to a very large 200 pound sack of potatoes. <laughs> it's a very large sack of potatoes. One morning I sat up a lot quicker than I normally would and in the process of doing so my right leg slammed down on top of my right testicle causing excruciating sharp pain unlike I have ever felt before. It's as if as though a tractor trailer had rolled on top of me. During that entire day nothing occurred. I thought I dodged a bullet. I went to sleep. Sometime in between then and when I got up, the testicle sac grew to literally the size of a soccer ball. And so I went to the emergency room where I was prescribed antibiotics to treat it as if as though maybe it was some sort of an infection. For years, I went to doctor after doctor and tried to find out what's wrong with my testicles and no one could give me a true satisfactory answer. I'm not able to wear pants. Instead of pants, I am forced to turn a hooded sweatshirt upside down and tuck inside the hood portion and clip it and with a safety pin or what have you and stick my legs through the arms of the hooded sweatshirt. Passion is a home health care attendant. She is very good at what she does. You're a bitch, right? You ready to eat? I've been ready. She has an incredibly cool personality. How the meatball taste? Pretty good. I really refer to him as my other man. <laughs> so I'm like, I wash and cook and, and everything for him. That's my other man. One benefit of the testicle sack is that sometimes it makes for a good resting spot for, the, for a plate, like a nice little table. 